I, from what I understand, I was one of the earlier people involved in It Starts With Us as a member of a part of this community, and I forgot now how I even found out about it, I'm sure through Twitter, and then saw one of the good things he was doing, and there was a blog post that Nate had written, and it was about, it was like 12 something with your boss and your employees, or I don't even remember it now, but it was awesome, and um, I, I loved it, and that's how I really started following him and finding out about It Starts With Us, and so I became a member of It Starts With Us and started seeing the missions, and I remember one of the missions that came out that was Pay It Backward, I think it was, and it was where it was basically saying, all right, everyone, and on the A-Team, which is what it was called, what it's called, you're on the A-Team, so you're a part of this community, and our mission this week is going to be Pay It Backward, which means if you can't afford it and if you have the opportunity to the person who's behind you, either through a drive through or wherever, groceries, um, buy their meal or, or do something nice for them. And so I went and did that a few times. And it's not that you don't think of these things, but when, when other people are talking about it, it makes it so much more real and it makes it seem easier. And then you have a purpose to go do it. There's a reason. You're not just doing it for no reason, you are doing it for a reason because it's something that you know a group of people are trying to do and it's planted that seed in your mind and once you know that other people are doing it, how could you not do it? <laughs> so um, my experience with it was being more inspired than I would have been without it, finding out and realizing that there are ways to connect with people, little ways to make a difference in people's lives, and then valuing the opportunity to talk to others about it. And when I saw the stories that other people would write, other A-Team members, it also made me think, okay, I feel good about myself, but there's more I can do. And imagine if we keep fueling each other to do good. Um, so personally for me, I think there's something really powerful about those stories being told that just perpetuate the inclination to do good. And maybe it makes us do those little things even more when it's not the mission and uh, when we don't have someone challenging us to do it. So for me, personally, it's reminded me to do the little things that are unexpected for people who don't know me and who I don't know. And I think that can only be a good thing for each of you individually as well.